Precision guided artillery shells. Terrifyingly effective or actually quite disappointing and easy to jam. Now these things aren't designed to replace regular dumb artillery rounds. They're way too expensive for that. With a single M982 Excalibur costing $112,000. I mean, even if your guns were firing just a tiny fraction of the artillery usage we're seeing in Ukraine. Firing precision guided munitions exclusively, you'd burn through millions of dollars in like an hour. And as grim as it sounds, there's absolutely still a place for just saturated saturating an area with artillery to harass and suppress the enemy. Now these are for when you really need to ensure precision to hit a relatively high value target. Depending on context, that might be an enemy command post, or even an inconveniently placed enemy tank or artillery system. Or for when friendly forces or civilians are too close to the target to risk a conventional bombardment. The way the Excalibur is guided after it leaves the gun barrel is using fins to steer its trajectory. But obviously the shell needs to know where to steer itself. For guided munitions, this data can be provided by GPS or onboard systems, infrared, laser, like the Excalibur here uses GPS guidance, in other words a signal from a satellite. This gives it a circular error probable of 4 meters, circular error probable being a metric of accuracy. In this case it means that on average half of all Excalibur rounds fired will fall within 4 meters of the target. Compare that to unguided artillery projectiles which can be up to 150 meters wide of the target. 